Chris, what's the level of satisfaction in your first start with a new team to have that type of performance? Yeah, it's good to get off the, on the right foot, um, but it's a long year, so um, yeah, it's just it is what it is. Buck described you as someone out on the mound who has a great imagination with your pitches. What, what do you think he meant by that? How would you describe what you're able to do out there? Yeah, um, I think I'm pretty damn good at reading someone's swing and just trying to toy with that. Um, I know I'm not the most power pitcher kind of thing, so I just try to keep everyone off balance. So I just try to add a pitch almost every year. Um, so far, it's kind of worked. Three zero to strike out Soto in that first strikeout of the night. Just what was your approach on that? I don't care who you are. I'm coming after you. I mean, I faced Otani a lot. I faced Trout a lot. Um, I I don't care the name on the back of your jersey. I'm coming. Um, that's been my mentality. No matter who I face, um, I know he's probably the best hitter in the world. But I don't I don't care. What what have you thought of the way this team's performed? I guess just you know, line up the diversity of the hitters, the pitching staff, just overall. I'm just curious. That's more you got. Yeah, I mean, the the payroll is one thing. You obviously expect a lot of talent, but I mean, I mean, we got two guys with completely busted mouths already two games in, and they're in the lineup the next day. Um, to be on a team that wants to grind as hard as this team, um, good luck. Um, there's a lot of guys, a lot of teams that it's all or nothing, and this team is not that. Um, we might be able to hit some homers, but we're just going to grind you until you break. And that's the mentality we've been preaching since day one. Um, we had the pitching staff to hold it down until that happens. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's exciting. I got a lot of friends and family that are pretty excited I'm on a different team. So, <laughs> uh, being, being on the West Coast for so long and being from the East Coast, we got uh, those 10 o'clock starts weren't great. So, yeah, um, yeah, my friends and family are here.